We're here today at what was once Stratford Junior High School, Virginia's first racially integrated school. The long battle to integrate Virginia's public schools followed the U.S. Supreme Court's decision in 1954's Brown versus the Board of Education, where the courts held that racially segregated schools are unconstitutional. The integration of Stratford Junior High School signaled the end of Virginia's massive resistance which involved closing schools rather than integrating them. It is for that reason and many more that this site is important to the County of Arlington, the state of Virginia, and the entire United States of America. Questions. Why was the integration of schools a challenge in the Commonwealth of Virginia? Why were many Arlington citizens in support of the need for integration? How might this historic event in Arlington's history have led to the diversity of the Arlington population that we have in the county today? Share your answers to the questions on any social media platform using hashtag APS historical markers to respond. We will highlight all the submissions on the APS website and social media sites. I was one of the students that entered uh, Stratford back in February 2nd, 1959 when we desegregated uh, Virginia schools and we entered through the store doors behind me to the, to the office of Principal Claude Richmond where, before we started classes. 